So I am having like the best freaking breakfast tea and my god this thing is going in. This is like some cream fiash, this is mascarpone and berries, me, me, me. This is covered in caramel. <laughs> it's the best time you guys, amazing. Hey you guys, it's Sunday and I have a concepts project due tomorrow. Oh, this is great. And um, basically this is just me sourcing fabrics for the project. Um, I need to get samples and then come back tomorrow and buy the full reels. Um, so yeah, this is me guys. I th honestly, I think that I love the times like I get, I'm like a kid in a candy store when I come fabric shopping because it's so crazy how many like, oh, this is perfect, oh my god, yes, this is perfect. How many fabrics, like inspiration can just come from anything and for me a lot of the times it comes from fabrics because i really just believe in textiles um over silhouette um like textiles can make can make a huge difference in terms of like a dress like if something has got a good texture then i'd buy it opposed to if it's got a better silhouette so i think that's my premise as a designer and oh my god these materials are amazing look at the texture ah oh. My god, what is this? And this is perfection. Okay, yeah, so this is Shwe Shwe na? These two. And this one. What is this called? Do you know? I don't know. Okay. Okay. I think this is just the tall. Guys, this Indian uncle who owns the fabric store has been talking. <laughs> He's one of those Indian people that don't like, you know, but shame, he's so nice, like, oh, my home guy, and he does that super Indian thing, I'll give you a good price, good price, so, <laughs> if you want it. <laughs> so, I just got home, and I'm doing this lovely thing called, am I getting a pump oil? This lovely thing called procrastination. <laughs> I'm so tired, and I don't want to work, you guys. Can I just get married and live nice and not do anything with my life? <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> this is good. So I think I'm just gonna clean my room because it's just a bit of a mess. Oh my guys, my room is great. I really love it here. Oh wow! Shout out to me. It's really messy right now. Though. But yeah, so I think I'm just gonna make my bed and then clean the rest of my room and then finish assignments. Yay! Guys, I was cleaning up my desk and I found like all of my old work from last year. So, wow, this is interesting. Um, this was a coat we had. This was like my first year sketches, guys, so don't judge me too hard. Or do, I don't care. Like, this is me, bro. <laughs> so, this was a coat we had for a month. This was, I remember this, I was struggling with skin tone at this point. <laughs> I'm still struggling, but it's a bit, it's not like they're in the Simpsons movie or anything now. And we were trying to learn how to, like, paint transparent clothing. Yeah, look at my face. Patricia is excited. Work on face looks like a Patrick. <laughs> wow. Dress done nicely. Oh, thanks. Okay, some fish. Amazing. Oh, okay. <laughs> so this is one of the techniques. This is like the second week in illustrating. And this is like a, a paint technique where you just put water, you wet the page, and then you put paint on it. And then you sort of got to like turn the page and do weird shit to, to get it to form. And then you're supposed to design like that. But it's more just like exploring techniques. It's not like a serious design. Cool. Oh, and this is like basic art. I know if anybody took art in high school or just art in culture, you remember doing this, like this thing. And ah, so much fun, darling. 
Oh, this is really cool. I remember this. I remember doing this and then I stepped back and I was so impressed with myself. This is made from tape, you guys. How cool. And it's got texture as well. That was like the whole like aim of it. Which is really dope. Shout out to me. Hey. Hey, hey. And, um, what else? Yes, I remember this. So we had to take a flower and, um, and take paper and then design without illustrating the dress you could illustrate the lady but you had to use paper and your flower inspiration to create a dress so this was mine and i couldn't remember what flower i took it was i fucking forgot i don't know but it was purple and it was really delicate and they sell them in woolwoods <laughs> i still don't remember the name and i literally did this project like two hours before it was due class started at nine i started the project at four finished at six and was finishing fucking um painting these people on the train to class <laughs> so yeah this is the other dress oh we only did two no oh, i think we did more oh yes this is really basic though so i just used tissue paper and i painted onto the tissue paper because the the petals on that flower was really ombre what did she say no inspiration pick missing the look suddenly hair is in blue <laughs> oh wow oh yes this was like a gypsy lady vibe thing peplum thing going on anyways and uh oh my god i remember this this was so fun this was where you had to create like a thing a person and a design using different techniques so you had to create using like continuous line and like that dripping technique where you wet the page first and then paint and then i used a sponge to create this like fluffy texture and then i can't remember what technique i used here i think it's the different types of shades on top of each other but it was really fun i remember wow and it really doesn't look that bad i was trying to create like waves in the skirt i don't know if it worked but that's really cool hey so you guys i'm done with this um this is what my customer profile is going to look like and um i painted it a gold lion because um my theme is i'm inspired by the culture of afrofuturism um, we had to choose a culture and then design a collection based off of that culture and i chose afrofuturism not knowing uh first there was a research paper and then i chose and then we had to take that culture we did in the research paper and apply it to the design class so yeah basically this is just because i think that you know african people are golden so and that's really cheesy but um this is why the line is painted gold and my customer analysis is gonna lay on top so yeah also on another note this is the the water from washing my paintbrushes how motherfucking magical is this shit my god like what
money never been an issue. Magazine covers we the issue. Uh, I'm shitting on them need a tissue. Uh, it's painful, nigga issue. Not me. Be on magazines. Make a flip a bean. Not me. <laughs> Pull up in a four door Audi. Drop a million on my bus and my Audi. All the champagne got me feeling rowdy. Windows down cause the shit is kinda cloudy. Not me. Cloudy. Not me. But you know I'm rowdy. Wanna fucking savage Cinderella to these hoes Tell him to bring out my carriage Baddest bitch you copped a bastard Leveled up and got my masters Hit the airport with no baggage And yes bitch I sign a cash for He the master Running up on him like caster Get your cash up All you bitches look like last year Need a catch up You fucked up and I'm still with Baxter Actually Rashford Free kicks for you fucking bastards Making money never been an issue Magazine covers we the issue uh, I'm shitting on them need a tissue uh, It's painful nigga issue Not me Be on magazines Make a flip a bean Not me <laughs> Pull up in a four door Audi Dropped a milli on my bus and my Audi All the champagne got me feeling rowdy Windows down cause the shit is kinda cloudy Bloody murder on my ankle, steady murmur. All you haters never heard of. I'm your maker, money earner. Yes, I'm paid for. My shit painful. All you bitches should be grateful. My shots fatal, like the shit you blocked up your nasal. My shit hateful. All you niggas on my payroll. It's okay though, they don't move until I say so. You want fame, ho? Find me on the 18th floor. On your man's face, that's what I call a face. Told you niggas I'm a fucking boss, yeah. Hey you guys, so I finished the project um, and this is what it looks like, the final one. Sorry, I'm vlogging you guys. <laughs> this is the information page. This is the trends forecast number one. Trends forecast number two and direction two. This is my customer profile and these are the lines that I painted yesterday. And this is the mood board, so, so it was either going to be really pa um, patterned or it was going to be more black and white, so I decided to do a mood board that just translated both. This is the patterns that I just drew, like just to experiment, you know, different kinds of stuff like that. And then these are just the sketches. <laughs> I don't think I, you really are. No. Like I feel like I know so much right now. You learning as well. You but, 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 but you Hey you guys, so I just realized that I forgot to have an ending to my blog vlog posting. So thanks for watching. That was my concepts project and I did make a blog post out of it. So please make sure to go to www.cardofficial dot com and check it out and stay tuned every thursday for a new video